Hi. Oh, it's still kind of dark out. It's five o'clock in the morning. Uh, I got up at 4.30 and I am heading to Algonquin to do a day paddle. I just had to pull over real quick and get a uh, little video clip of the sun coming up. This has been my drive so far this morning. Good morning. Well, it's uh, about 6.45 and I am here at the Ox Tongue River at the put-in. Got everything uh, out of the car and the canoe is here by the water. It's supposed to be partly cloudy. <laughs> um, I don't think it's even partly sunny. Uh, it's really overcast. The bugs are out in full force um, and uh, I couldn't be happier to be here. Uh, I don't even care about the bugs. I don't care about anything. I'm so excited to get on the water and uh, I'm going to do that right now, so let's go. I am out on the water in my new canoe and I'm super stoked! Ah. When my alarm went off at 4.15 this morning, I did not want to get up. I actually hit the snooze button and was just laid there for a second and I was like, I gotta go, I gotta get there early. I don't think it's going to be too busy here today because of uh, the weather that's coming and the weather that is. Uh, all the roads actually on the 60 were soaking wet, so it must have just rained here. But it's good now, and uh, I'm excited. I'm super happy to be here. fishermen up here. Good morning. Pretty nice out here. 
and um, even though it is overcast and the bugs are out, uh, the motion with the boat and uh, the wind that I'm creating paddling is keeping them off of me. And uh, it's just a great day to be outside. I am so happy to be here and so grateful for this beautiful canoe that I'm paddling. Um, I love it. It's just perfect for me. It's a perfect size and uh, I feel totally comfortable in it. Um, and uh, I can't wait to do some camping trips in it. Just beautiful out here. When I was a kid, uh, we had a pool ever since I was little. And uh, I am a Pisces and I've always loved the water. Uh, I used to go down as a teenager to like the creek and the river and I would watch all the speed boats go by and I would bring like blow up dinghies and air mattresses just so I could be out on the water and paddle with my hands. Um, and just, just because I wanted to be on the water so bad. Um, when I got older, uh, I finally purchased a kayak um, in 2004, somewhere around there. And uh, I got some instruction from Jamie, who is the owner of Outdoors Oriented. And uh, I did my basic kayaking course at that time. Um, and then I did some trips with some random people I met on the internet, which back then was kind of weird. Uh, and I loved it. I just love being out on the water. Um, I began my uh, paddling career, I guess, kayaking, um, because back then you didn't really solo canoe. Canoeing was for two people. And uh, I don't know, maybe someone was out there doing it back then, but it wasn't really a thing. Um, and so I kayaked as much as I could. And uh, now that I live in Muskoka, I get to paddle as much as I want. I'm surrounded by water and uh, I do my best to get out almost every single weekend um, paddling and going kayak camping, going canoe camping, going canoe tripping and um, I'm just truly grateful to be able to do this and I'm grateful for all these amazing places that we have to paddle. I mean just look at this view, it's just gorgeous. Oh, I'm getting very very close to Ragged Falls. Uh, I'm actually here. beautiful as this. I could just sit here all day. It's so nice and serene. It sounds amazing. There's all kinds of ducks and herons and stuff going past and uh, it's just gorgeous out here. I am so happy to be out here and um, I can't wait for backcountry camping to start. Uh, I'm dying to go out on a trip. I, I've, uh, I think last year at this time I'd already been out on a few trips. Three maybe. Um, so I'm um, really looking forward to getting out there and camping, um, but for now, paddling, uh, you know, it's a pretty close second and uh, I'm super excited to be able to live so close to such a beautiful area and uh, to be able to just drive like a little over an hour and then get to experience this. just as I'm almost back at the parking lot, the sun is making an appearance. <laughs> Too funny. It's 
beautiful out here. There's a kayak here at the launch. I'll just keep my distance. Well, yesterday when I was in my backyard, I was curious how the pattern would look in the water. And the sun's not fully out, but uh, it's a little bit brighter than it was when I got here. And you can see the, uh, the pattern in the boat. Just gorgeous. I love it. It's so pretty. Now that I've finished my paddle, the sun has come out, um, but that's okay. I had a great time. It was a wonderful first paddle of the season. Great uh, first paddle with the H2O ProLite 14.6 in green Kevlar. And um, now that the sun is out, the bugs are swarming again, but they're still not bothering me, so that's good. Um, I'm going to tie the uh, canoe up onto the car and uh, head out. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and I uh, hope, hope you subscribe. If you like what you saw, please click the subscribe button. I would really appreciate your support. Um, also, if you look below in the description of the video, you'll see a whole bunch of affiliate links, which are um, brands that I'm affiliated with. And if you click the link and make a purchase through some of those links, um, I get a small commission, which is nice. And that helps uh, fund my trips and my videos and stuff like that. So I appreciate your support more than I can say. Thanks so much for watching and I hope to see you again soon. Bye.